Sammy, there are always a few trade murmurs around this time of the year, but you've knocked over your contract nice and quickly. What was the process for that one? Um, yeah, it was a little bit of a process, but um, to, to be honest, man, I'm wrapped. It's, uh, yeah, to be able to stay at the club and yeah, hopefully be a part of a pretty successful future will be, um, will be huge for me. And yeah, um, over the moon, mate. Obviously, the boys are in the grand final this weekend. You're not going to be a part of that, but getting the success in future years, is that a big key to signing this contract? Yeah, it is a big driving factor, obviously. It's disappointing not to be out there this weekend, but I think over the last month being in this hub, it's been a great chance for me to sort of reflect and I'll just be happy for my mates, to be honest, like to see see some of my close mates have hopefully have success on the weekend and, and be a part of it, even if it's um, like we're a whole squad. So. Yeah, to enjoy that with them is going to be really important. So, yeah, just try and be the best teammate I can through this period and hopefully be a part of it in the future. There's been a lot of talk about how it takes 45 players to win a flag. Have you enjoyed being here? It's obviously tough being in a hub away from home, but it has been a pretty good uh, bond amongst the group. Yeah, yeah. Just I, upon reflection, I think the last two weeks have been some of the more enjoyable times I've had in, in footy and I think it's just a great chance for us to connect and I think obviously finals brings brings us closer but yeah to be able to be a part of a grand final build up and experience the game and I don't know it's been a really enjoyable time and obviously I love the boys and I love the club so it's just been a great place to be. How much was loyalty a driving factor in you signing on? It was massive yeah I mean coming to the club we were we were slowly building, but we were still in that rebuild phase. And I don't know, to go through, I really wanted to be a part of that. And I don't know, I, I obviously I haven't been exactly happy with my career up to this point, but I still feel I have a lot to give and um, I want to repay the faith the club's put in me. And I don't know, it's, yeah, it's a big factor in me staying, of course. Um, I love the club, love the people, and yeah, really want to be a part of some success. You've played 49 games across six seasons. How have you seen your start so far? Yeah, look, it hasn't been ideal. Um, yeah, it's, it's obviously not the career I've, I've hoped for up to this point. Um, been very inconsistent and yeah, haven't been really playing the way I wanted to, but I still feel like I've got a lot to give and there's, um, I think, op opportunities big and I need to start grasping them a bit, a bit better. And look, I'm really optimistic about the future and I'm really positive that I can um, have an impact uh, on the game and with this club and yeah, I'm desperate, desperate to be a part of success in the future and like, the boys are backing me and the coaches are as well. So yeah, I'm, I'm really, really happy to be here for, for the future. There's obviously a lot of competition for spots in the forward line as well, but you're coming in to the prime of your career, you're 24 at the moment. Have you got a lot of confidence that you can fight your way in? Yeah, yeah. I'm very extremely motivated to get into the team and, and stay in the team. I mean, we've got a lot of great key forwards up there and so there's a lot of challenges, but I think working with those guys helps me a lot and, um, and just trying to beat them, I guess. It's, like, it's a comp competitive um, area of the ground and yeah, I'm going to work, work bloody hard to get, get in that team and stay in there.